So I originally I saw the, the Sound Escape poster and just thought it would be a really good opportunity for me to explore my creative side in the summer. I didn't really think that it would lead me on the path to where I am now, but they've been really useful at kind of supporting me and helping me explore my creative side and my musical kind of style and build it to the best it can be. I do music at uni, um, but I mean for like creating house stuff and like dance music. Um, it was more just like working with like Tinetic and Tom and he kind of just like said, oh, the track you've made is really good, why don't you try it and push it a little bit more? And then that was kind of how First Glance came about and that's kind of been like the big thing that I've like focused everything around, which has kind of led me to here. So uh, my name is Ruby Tipple, um, I'm an acoustic singer-songwriter and I'm really happy to be here tonight at such a lovely venue. Um, with two absolutely amazing artists following me. I hope you enjoy them as much as I do. to Arts at Extra a counsellor. Um, he, he managed to get into contact with Arts at Extra, put us two together, and it was just really a starting point for me to actually go and build on what I already had. My music beforehand wasn't great, and it was just that experience that has brought me to where I am now, um, and also brought the talent that I had in the outside, because otherwise I just don't think I would have been able to do it. Um, and it's probably been one of the best decisions of my life because I don't think a I would know what I want to do when I'm older without I've got been going to the arts today, the studio, meeting Tom, the rest of them, brilliant. I and I think I kind of like signed up because I want to like push myself out there, like musically as well. And when I saw it and I signed up and then it was successful, I was like, oh, it's just everything just fell into place, kind of like, perfectly, really. The storms continue to rage and the community is blamed by Sackleton and Fern in a bid to secure a future for himself and his fellow survivors. Moss braved the dangers that lie beyond the district, but he soon discovers that the storms are not the only threat to his survival. Other survivors, some with malicious intentions, roam the wasteland. Yeah! Soundscapes was really, really positive. It was a really just good atmosphere to create music, collaborate with other young people in kind of a safe space where experimentation is kind of encouraged. You've got people there who might be able to help you out or just kind of be a soundboard for your ideas. So it was really useful for me. Just do it, I think, because I was like on the edge of like, oh, should I apply to genetics? Should I? Shouldn't I? What should I do? Blah, blah, blah. And then once I actually applied, I was like, this is probably the best thing that I've done. I should have done it like way sooner. Um, so I think just put yourself out there and do it. It's so scary. But I think once you do it and you start to like reap the rewards, then you're like, oh, it's paying off. Especially that's what I've noticed for me anyways. Like everything has just paid off, so yeah. So before Arts at X, my music was very bland. No, I was never able to get my expression out. It was very... I always used to rush my music, there was no, that you would never take a feeling away from a song. It always just felt heartless, it just, it just felt, it felt like nothing. But now, ever since I've been to Arts and Dance, being around people who have been in the industry, and being, had, had people there to bring out of me what, what I kept inside all them years by doing it by myself, that's what impacted me the most, and being able to change from being someone who would just sit in front of a mic with having no idea what to do um, and also just being afraid of, I don't know, I was just... You get really nervous when you yeah, started music. I was very nervous, whatever. Ever since I've been to Arts at X, that all just went down the drain. I was just so ready just to put myself out there and make everything. Every, every time I've released, ten times better than the other and I feel like that's... That's going to be proven by next album, District Zero, coming out this year.
Do we have time for one more? I'm laid back, sweet dreams that you felt on my dream.